Hello, this is a simple prototype for the script engine. I'm going to just show you a few of its features. There's going to be a lot that changes uh, as we go to the final version, so do not use this as a tutorial. Um, first off, I want to make a box, and so I just specify two points, um, two corners of the box, and it will create it for me and the points are specified by X, Y, and Z coordinates. So I made a box. I have to tell display about it, so I have to type display and feed it the box. And after I do that, I should be able to hit generate and it creates a box. There you see the box. Um, say I type something in wrong, say I take the X away, it'll tell me that um, an exception has been, has occurred and it'll tell you what it was. And so you can go back up there and see what you need to fix. Uh, and voila, we have a box again. Now let's do something with a box. I think it'd be cool to cut a gear out of the inside of it. Um, so I actually have another script that was written that um, makes gear generation uh, pretty trivial. So all I have to do it, to make a gear is feed it the uh, center point uh, feed it the thickness, um, feed it the pitch, that's a technical gear term if, in case you're not up on your gears, and you have to feed it um, the um, radius. So here I'm specifying the thickness is 0.5 inches, the pitch is 12, and the radius is 1.5. Now I've made the gear, I have to do something with it. So I'm going to take the box and I'm going to use the cut command and cut away the gear. And that's really all there is to it. Um, and now I'll be displaying the box, and since I'm calling it after the cut command, it should display the correct cut box. And there you see it. Um, and I think it would be extra cool if I could put a smaller gear and make it mesh with the other one. Um, so I'm going to reuse that variable gear because I've already used it uh, to do what I needed to do. And I'm going to feed it a different point. This time I'm going to move it over three quarters of an inch um, from where the first gear was. And I'm going to make the gear half as big so it um, will mesh just perfectly with the outside ring. Um, same thickness, same pitch because gears have to have the same pitch to be able to mesh. And. The problem I'm going to have is um, if I just put generate now, it wouldn't show the other gear. I actually have to tell it to display it. So here I'm typing display gear, and that should do everything I need to to show the whole shebang. And there we have it. That's yeah, pretty easy. Um, hope you enjoyed this. Uh, pretty soon the. Uh, this will be available for anybody to use and it'll be much different. Hopefully we'll have some good tutorials for you guys to learn how to do this. Thank you.